CAPE WILL ONLY BE ABLE TO SERVE A QUARTER OF THE FAMILIES IT USUALLY DOES THIS WINTER BECAUSE THE FUNDING FOR ENERGY ASSISTANCE HAS BEEN CUT BY MILLIONS OF DOLLARS. WITH THE TEMPERATURES GETTING COLDER, MANY PEOPLE ARE DOING WHATEVER THEY CAN TO GET HELP. BUNDLED IN BLANKETS, PEOPLE WERE ALREADY LINED UP OUTSIDE OF CAPE'S BUILDING AT 6 THIS MORNING, HOPING FOR AN APPOINTMENT TO GET HELP WITH THEIR HEATING BILLS. And IF I DON'T GET HELP NOW, THEN uh, THEY'RE GOING TO SHUT ME OFF. But once the doors open, no appointments are handed out. Everyone is told they can be put on a waiting list and they will be contacted when more funds are available. And I've been down here since 9.30, 10 o'clock last night, and I was expecting to get help and we're not, nobody's getting help. You're fighting for a spot in line to be turned down and I have no resources out there to help me. I've exhausted them. CAPE EXECUTIVE DIRECTOR ALICE WEATHERS SAYS THIS ISN'T THE FIRST TIME PEOPLE HAVE CAMPED OUT. THE ASSISTANCE THAT THE PROGRAM GIVES IS SO IMPORTANT AND HAS SUCH A BIG IMPACT ON THEIR BUDGETS, THEY'RE WILLING TO DO THAT. WEATHERS SAYS APPOINTMENTS FOR ENERGY ASSISTANCE ARE BOOKED ALL THE WAY THROUGH NOVEMBER. I'M TOLD THE APPOINTMENTS THAT WERE HANDED OUT ON TUESDAY WERE ONLY FOR CLIENTS WITH DISCONNECT NOTICES OR WHO HAVE ALREADY BEEN CUT OFF. AS FOR EVERYONE ELSE, THE WAITING GAME CONTINUES. AND WE ARE NOW uh, TAKING NAMES TO PUT ON THE CALL BACK LIST. AND I THINK WE HAVE ABOUT A THOUSAND NAMES ON THAT LIST SO FAR. SEVERAL PEOPLE I SPOKE WITH SAY WHILE THE WAIT IS FRUSTRATING, CAPE IS NOT THE ONE TO BLAME. THEY'RE JUST THERE TO HELP. AND IF THEY DON'T HAVE THE FUNDINGS TO HELP, you can't blame them, but you can blame Vectran for high, hiking it up. I'm told there is hope for those waiting on the callback list. We expect to know if there will be additional money, and I think there will be, but we expect to know that at least by the first of next week. If funding becomes available, Weather says she will turn to the waiting list starting at the top and serve as many people as the funding will allow. If you would like to get on the waiting list for energy assistance, we've posted the information on our website, news25.us. It's under the links and more section. Andrea Gachewski, News 25.